Measured features are measured directly by using QVPAC's video tools to collect data points from the workpiece. There are nine measured features, namely point, line, circle, ellipse, plane, sphere, stepped cylinder, cylinder, and cone. Although data points are used to create features once measured or constructed, they are described by feature characteristics. To activate the GDNT results, you have to click the nominal checkbox and add in the tolerance. For more information on nominals and tolerances, you can check them out under the QV Pack tab. I will introduce the first measured feature, the point feature. The point feature is used to indicate a specific location on the workpiece, such as the point where two edges come together. It is described by its coordinates in three dimensions. At a minimum, one data point is needed to define a point feature. The characteristics given are the feature coordinates, concentricity, true position, and also symmetry. Next, we have the line feature. The line feature is often used to indicate a straight edge of a workpiece. At the minimum, two data points are needed to define a line feature. This will accumulate the results of the feature coordinates, angle, X, Y, Z, angle, straightness, parallelism, perpendicularity, angularity, coaxiality, and symmetry. Third is the circle feature. A circle is described by the coordinates and radius of the circle and the characteristics of the data points used to create the circle feature. At the minimum, three data points on the same plane are needed to define a circle feature. The result will show the feature coordinates, diameter, radius, circularity, concentricity, true position, runout, and symmetry. Fourth, we have the ellipse feature. An ellipse is described by the coordinates of the ellipse, the long axis also known as diameter 1, the short axis also known as diameter 2 as well as the characteristics of the data points used to create the feature. At a minimum, five data points on the same plane are needed to define the ellipse feature. The result will show the feature coordinates, angle, x-angle, y-angle, z-angle, diameter, concentricity, true position, and symmetry.